Hello and welcome to Visions of Mana. Uh, Visions of Mana is a 2024 action RPG published by Square Enix and developed by Oka Studios. Uh, this is a kind of major return to a uh, previously pretty legendary series of games. Uh, this is the newest game in the Mana series and really the first entry since like the PS2 era um, where there were, were quite a few missteps that kind of led this series to go dormant. Um, but in recent years, uh, we got a bunch of remakes to relatively... I wouldn't say amazing, but like lightly positive reception. Um, there was a Secret of Mana remake that uh, came out in like 2016 or 17 or something uh, that was kind of janky, but worked. Um, there was a Final Fantasy Adventure remake, the first uh, the first Mana game, the first Seiken Densetsu game uh, that came out for like iOS and Vita. Um, that was a very straight remake of the first uh, Mana game uh, that most people probably haven't played. I've played it. Um, and then finally, we got a official localization of Trials of Mana, also known as Seiken Densetsu 3. Very legendary game in the emulation world and the fan translation world. Uh, that got ported over to Switch in a Mana collection and then got a full-on 3D remake called Trials of Mana. Um, which some people might have played. That got pretty good reception and uh, was pretty popular, I think. And so finally, we got Visions of Mana, a new game in the Mana series. So just off the bat, uh, this game is... Uh, you don't need any prior knowledge of the Mana series at all to play it, from what I understand. Basically, none of the Mana games are really actually connected. They kind of exist in that like Final Fantasy space of like every game has like some recurring ideas, but uh, it's all like n not direct sequels, right? There might be some in the series that have sequels. I don't really remember. Uh, my background with the Mana series is that I've always really liked them, and I think that their art is really cool and their music is really good. Um, but I also played them when I was really young. Um, the Mana games were really interesting examples of, like, legendary or popular Super Nintendo, specifically Secret of Mana and Sega Nintendo 3, really popular Super Nintendo games that, like, got an even bigger following online because emulation. Um, they were very, very easy games to emulate, and they were some of the earliest examples of, like, emulator net play because uh, back in the day... The, uh, the emulators that we used, like emulators like ZSNES and uh, SNES 9X and things like that, uh, you could basically play multiplayer with them. And a lot of people had access to like low end hardware that could run Super Nintendo games just fine. So I have really fond memories of playing uh, Secret of Mana and Seiken Densetsu 3 either over Netplay or just on like a shared school laptop with like a USB drive in like the computer lab with my friends. Um, and so that's my exposure to the series. And with this new one coming out, I was really interested um, and I just wanted to, to jump in. So let's give it a, uh, let's give it a go. I haven't really meddled with anything. I don't know uh, what this game is going to be like. I don't even know what it looks like other than this title screen. I see that it has furries, so that's cool. Uh, so let's give it a try. I've heard that we should play these games on hard because the remakes were really easy. I haven't played any of the remakes. her duties and attempting to flee but the earth elemental's protection is nearly spent at this rate the very fabric of this realm will fray this place will no longer receive the blessings of mana power hmm. <laughs> that limp sync was crazy Liza, how's your foot can you make it 
I'm fine. But, Oren, listen. I don't think it's right to run away. It's too late for that now, Liza. See? We're nearly to the gate. We have to hurry before they realize what we're doing. Come on! Okay, that's Dodge. I thought you said we were heading to the gate. How do I run? Is there a run button? There is. Okay, left bumper. Or not left bumper, left stick. Past the gate up ahead? We aren't watching all the exits to the village yet. Hurry. Oh, that's weird. Left bumper being on the right side of the screen like that. <laughs> What are you two doing out here so late? Hmm, hang on. Where do you think you're taking our Liza? No, this route won't work. Let's try the other way. Huh. Can we interact with anyone? Fancy seeing you two here. What are you up to this time? Oren? Hey! There are too many people here. We have to make for the bridge. Can I yeah. jump down there? Whoa, that is a expressive jump animation. <laughs> huh? Huh? You cannot take Liza from the village like this, Oren. The Soul Guard is on his way. You have to wait here for him. If you won't be reasoned with. We will have to make you stay by force! Oren, what should we do? We... we have no choice! Oh. Blast! Now where do we go? Come on, Liza! This way! Thanks! Oh. <laughs> okay. Who's next? Ow. Oh, and I can air combo. Okay. How's this? Okay, and there is heavy attacks. Stay out of this, okay? The voice acting itself isn't terrible. I actually kind of like it. Yeah. I mean, maybe the side characters are crazy, but like the Orin and Liza and stuff, they're nice. Oh, this game's got like kind of wacky movement. So the Mana series is known for like these like painterly backgrounds and very like expressive kind of character art. I can't remember the name of the artist. I think Koichi Ishii, maybe Ishii Koichi. I don't remember. Uh, he's really well associated with the series. What now? There's just the sand wheel ahead and no way past it. I know. That's the plan. It's all up from here. I guess we'll see. Huh. So we have to wait for the wheel? Or is it? Which way is it? It's right here. Okay. That one better than I thought. For you? I was shaking the whole way up. <laughs> Sorry about that. Didn't realize you're afraid of heights. Uh. But yeah, the Mana series is like very tied to like environmentalism. Like that's like the big, you know, key theme of all of them is like not even environmentalism, but like nature and the power of Earth. Um, it, it's just kind of kind of fun set dressing. Think about what you're doing, Oren. This is madness. We don't want to hurt you. Either of you. You can't be serious about fleeing the village. You just can't be. It's not madness. It's survival. 
I'm so sorry. Zinnis! Zinnis! Did that do it? Why did it come to this? Oh yeah, the ring menu. So this is a uh, this is a key aspect of the series. It sounds crazy to say that like characters having their own menus. We don't have time for this right now. Was a big innovation, but during the Super Nintendo era, it was, and so that's a big flavor for the rest of the the series. Is that the ring menu constantly comes back? It's for uh, just using character inventories and selecting spells and stuff. Warren, Liza! Huh? Don't! I'm not here to harm you. Listen to me. Without Liza as the alm of our village, Guju will fall to ruin. An alm's sacred duty is to offer their soul to the Tree of Mana. They ensure life and prosperity for the rest of us. You know this. I know you do. Of course we do. But we can't give up our happiness. We've gone through so much to be together. And you should know that. I do, Oren. It's rare for someone to settle down in a village other than where they were raised. People worried that Liza would feel estranged here when they heard of your engagement. But time passed, and we came to love her as one of our own. I was so happy to see her flourishing. Happy for you both. You're not the only one who doesn't want to lose her, Oren. Then don't stop us! Oren, maybe he's right. I have a duty to fulfill, as the Alm. Absolutely not! We're going to leave, run away, and we'll keep running, and running until the world forgets all about Alms, until the world is free from this cycle of sacrifice! Oren... Liza is right. Listen to her, Oren. Return to us. No! Stay back! I am not your enemy, Oren. I'm your friend, and I'm here to help I you. I said stay back! <laughs> so expressive. Got him. Hang him by her feet. That was a weird animation. Oren, I... Come on, Liza. Do you ever lose your way in your adventures, press life? left bumper and wide, summon a trail of light that will show you the way to your next Sorry, objective. Dan. He's not hanging there anymore. He must have made it off. We're good. Who is this? What? Hey, Oren. You have to go back. Liza, what are you doing? We have to head to the plateau. It's not safe to linger here. Guess we won't be coming back anytime soon. No. This is goodbye to Guju. But let's head for Lagrazzo. The Dark Archives have the largest library in the world. They've got to have something that can help us. Huh? You 
used to be a soul guard, Liza. You know how important an alms duty is. Orin, you have to turn back. You're forcing our hand. We don't want to fight you, but we will. Please let us go. I beg you. If we allow you to escape with the all, the whole village will suffer. It's not too late to stop this. Please, Orin. I understand that we're risking. I do, but I won't stand aside. So colorful. Okay, you can do like a weird parry sort of. Right. I'll beat the earth up. It's fine. No! We will escape! Is this? It's coming. Get ready. Yeah. Yeah. Let's send this. It's human shape. Not good. It worked. Yeah. What's this? So I don't really have a stamina meter. Step aside. Yeah. What's this? Okay, so that dodge doesn't actually give iframes. It's just movement. Starting to rampage. Watch out! Why won't you stay down? Yeah, it just gives iframes. Take that! Send this! Thanks for the help. Is this our punishment for defying the rules of the pilgrimage? Orin! Well, I'm not backing down! We're doing this because we have to. Not because we want to. Yeah. Oh God. There we go. What's this? What's this? Nothing. There we go. Took him out. It's over. <sighs> Let's go, Liza. If 
Is he going to jump? Feels like it might be building up to something like We're that. Safe now. Let's go. Liza? Oh, Orin? Orin, it hurts. My body won't move. Liza? Liza! No! What? What's happening? Wait! No! You'll be fine. It just... Oh no. Orin, I'm sorry. How cruel to be claimed by the earth. Kind of like a fridge horrifying world where it's like, no, the earth just needs to eat your soul. Cool, cool opening animation. Let's see this. Ryosuke Yoshida, Yoshida Ryosuke, and Ozawa Kenji. Good old directors. I don't know how to describe music like this, but it is fun. I always feel like I'm getting into like a cool fantasy universe when the fantasy music sounds like this instead of just generic orchestral Lord of the Rings music, you know? Flute and flute. This is cool. Monster design, design supervision by people at Grezzo. That's interesting. They're the people that make the um, Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask remakes and stuff, I think, right? I'm going to look that up. I think they also worked on a Dragon Quest remake, maybe? Tiania, the Fire Village. A quiet settlement where generation upon generation of townsfolk have lived oh, yeah. in peace. Aside from the occasional flare-up from the nearby volcano, we have prospered from the blessings of fire, the patron element of our village. And so, our way of living has continued. Today, we honor tradition to ensure the survival of our people. Today is the day that the fairy appears. I'm crazy. Ishii Koichi, the, the kind of creator of this series, or the, the artistic guy behind them, uh, is the CEO of Grezzo. So of course the monster designs done by him. And yeah, he did work on or they Grezzo did work on major, uh, the uh, Zelda I remakes. Which way fairy will come from this time. Her voice sounds really familiar and I don't know why. And Grezzo is also known primarily for working on the Final Fantasy 11 expansion packs which is my background you finally get your chance to be a soul guard fulfill your duty faithfully val 
I will, Dad. Oh. Carry on Liza's legacy with pride. That's a guy. Don't let anyone down. <laughs> I didn't know that. I thought that was a lady. Especially with the name Val. <laughs> a soul guard's job is really important. We'd sacrifice it all to protect the alms on their journey to the mana tree and ensure they fulfill their duty to the world. That's why fighting prowess is only a small part of what you need to become a soul guard. What matters most is your heart. Liza, huh? Come to think of it, we never did hear much from her after she settled down in the Earth Village, did we? It's been four years since the Alm from Guju disappeared and brought about the destruction of their village. No word as to whether Liza made it out or not, either. In any case, once the Alms reach the tree, you better come straight home. Hina would be inconsolable. Yeah, yeah, I know. Val, it's almost time for the fairy's arrival. Don't you need to pick up Hina on your way? Oh, whoops. I better go. Cool. The whole village is excited for the festival. Yes! Niccolo coin. Opulent incense. Increases lucre gain. Coin you can change at Niccolo's Emporium for goods. Niccolo is a big fat rabbit merchant. This game has fat rabbit merchants. Val? Your father and I will stay here, Val. Go on then. Hina's waiting for you. You made plans to meet up with her, didn't you? Yes. Uh. As long as I'm a blacksmith, there'll be no festivals for me. I can't take my eyes off the forge no matter what. Okay, so not everyone can be spoken to. Oh, I have the same jumping animation as the other guy. Yes. Gold clover. Taking this. Luker. Currency you use to buy yes. goods at the shop. I hope that this is just tutorializing and it's not gonna do this every time we pick something up. This is kind of exciting. Nice. Yay, candy. Oh man, this world is so pretty though. Look at this. <laughs> it's actually really nice. It's like so vibrant. It's awesome. All right, let's talk to everyone, figure out what we need to do. Oh yeah, the little dancing merchants. This is like a thing. This is, the, the, you know, what chocobos are to Final Fantasy. I guess chocobos also exist in mana, sort of. They're an adventure of mana, but the merchants all dance for some reason. Welcome. I'd love to go see more of the festivities, but I got a business to run. Big events like this are my busiest Welcome. times of the year. Please peruse what we have. Patchwork vest. Do I need Please to buy it? Peruse what we have. Come again soon. I got my okay. Players procure the additional downloadable content access from special outfits from the appearance section of the gear menu. Oh, okay. Guards blade, guardian garment. I like that. Wear a shirt, you freak. Interesting. Will it actually show up in cutscenes is the question. It looked like some of those appearances, like DLC appearances and stuff, were... Um, Oh, interesting. We can we can set the voice language in just the gameplay menu. That's neat. Do I even need FSR on? Does it make the game look that noticeably different? Not really. Uh Let me see. Nice. nice. Very acorn, very useful. Uh it looks like there were like DLC appearances or something, so maybe I can play with those in the future. One of them reminded me of the the yes adventure of Mana, the very first Mana games, uh, like redesigned player character. So yes, maybe there's some like 
se like series history options. That's always fun. I love added costumes. Number one way to make me love a video game is to put costumes in it. Okay, I can't use my sword right now. Yes. I like the art style a lot too. Just really neat. Whoa, he did like a parkour. Nice. I'm really curious about the Japanese voices, but I don't want to switch it just for one cutscene, so. Yes. Taking this. Let me see. Nice. All right, candy. Uh, normally, I like to set the language to either whatever the uh, language of origin was or whatever it's lip synced to. Um, but at the same time, I don't know if this game is going to actually be lip synced to Japanese because <laughs> it might just be lip flaps, you know, like characters just kind of babble and then. In a rush, are you, Val? Be sure you are respectful and attentive when you attend the festival tonight. I will be, Master Fugo. I remember what Liza always told me about a soul guard's duties. Yes, Liza is an excellent example. Our ancestor was appointed by the goddess of mana herself to protect the alms. Since then, the soul guard has always been selected from Tiania to... Yeah, yeah. I've had enough of history lessons. Now it's time to put my training to the test. And tests you shall face. Just remember that you possess a rare ability not seen in this village for ages. Your talent for turning monsters into stones will serve you well in your travels. Uh, <laughs> exposition. Now, you must see that no harm comes to the alms, be it monster or creature that stands in your way. Uh, sorry, Master Fugo, but I really gotta go. Hina's waiting for me and I don't want to be late. He's running to school with toast in his mouth. I know I should listen to what he says, but Master Fugo always... You can fast travel to other meridians as long as they're located on the same continent. Okay, interesting. Rambles, Hina's probably waiting for me. <laughs> Can't close up shop just because festival's underway. Now then, what can I get for you? What can I get for you? Couple wishes. Revi revised painted ally restores all HP. Please eh. come again. I don't need anything else. Hey. Phew, I'm a bundle of nerves right now. At least you've already been given your position as soul guard. Lucky you, Val. Given that the characters uh, aren't uh, uniformly voiced, I probably won't switch it to Japanese. I don't have the chops to be a soul guard, but the chance I'll be selected as an alm is still there no matter how slim. <sighs> if I get to be selected to be the alm, I'd have to break things off with my betrothed, but that's the price I'm willing to pay to uphold this age-old tradition. Hello. Where's the best spot to wait for the fairy? I want to be right in her line of sight when she chooses the alm, or does she not like people who try too hard? Try too hard. Not a lot of travelers visit our humble little village. We get the occasional merchant, but that's about it. Yeah, it can get pretty dull here at times. Hello. As the festival draws nearer, the furnaces burn hotter and hotter with each passing day. Mysterious, isn't it? Okay. I just ate a mountain of magma melt, so I'm a shoo in to be the alm. Oh, I'm getting all nervous again. Maybe I'll just have one more. Okay. Festivals are the perfect time for some magma melts. The alm of fire has always been always has some before leaving on their pilgrimage. Hey, don't blame me for trying to make some extra coin. Okay. If you start getting cold feet about the whole soul guard gig, I can take your place. Nah, I'm just joking. You're the best the village has to offer, Val. All right, let's just continue to pick up all the items around before we this. do whatever else needs to be done. Yes. Another gold clover. Those seem useful. Taking this. A rare item! Nice, couple wishes. <sighs> I've been alone here, over here, chopping wood for the festival all live long day. Do you think my hard work will get the fairy's attention? People really want to be sacrificed. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, that doesn't deal damage to me though, so that's fine. 
taking this. My sheep aren't used to the hustle and bustle of a festival. If I don't keep an eye on them, they'll go running off who knows where. Yes. Look at all these chests just Let scattered around this village. Nice. Lucre, very useful to have. Just need money. Yes. Candy. <laughs> My husband is such a worrywart. If he keeps doting over those sheep of his, he'll never attend a single festival in his entire life. Alright, where is it leading me? Okay, Hina's up here. Mm. We pick our fruits once a year, but the fairy chooses the alms once every four. I guess you could say that means the alms are four times as precious. Oh. I was helping carry some flowers for the bonfire earlier. Now I smell like a walking flower shop. Here, take a whiff. <laughs> oh. The soul guard and all the alms go to this place called the Mana Tree. I heard it's really far from here. Taking... Sorry, Hina. I lost track of time. Well, well. I see someone's excited about becoming a soul guard. Or is it nerves? <laughs> I can't say I'm thrilled to see you go. But I'll pray for your safe return every day. I won't let you down. I know you won't. Let's head to the square. Hmm. Any guesses as to who will be named the Alm this year? Not sure. Seems like anyone would be happy to get the job. I just love these environments, they're so painterly. I guess I didn't go up that way. I probably should have. Oops. Let's go up here and collect everything up here so we don't miss anything. Yes! Taking this? Yeah, look, I would have missed this. What a shame that would have been. This is kind of exciting. Nice! More lucre. This game looks yes. great. This game is gonna look great in 15 years. This? Like this, this art is just fantastic. It's almost time for me to set out on the pilgrimage with the Alma Fire. I'm gonna be the best soul guard I can be. Okay, so there's nothing up there other than uh, <laughs> that. That's a really floaty jump. Okay. Festival only comes once every four years. I even finished up work earlier than usual today to make sure I didn't miss it. Uh huh. Who will be selected as the own this year? Someone whose heart burns with passion and ardor or someone whose soul kindles warmth and kindness? I thought the game crashed for a second. <laughs> Over here. There! It's the fairy! Oh, She's so beautiful. Uh, I could be the alm. Oh, fairy. Excuse me as the alm. I Please will bring prosperity me. to the village. Uh, it would be an honor to be named the Alm. Fairy, grant me the honor of becoming an Alm. I would proudly offer my soul. Huh? Uh. Death culty, just a little bit. Oh, congratulations! Yay! 
Oh, my goodness. Wow. Bell's just excited because this means he gets to travel together with Hina. Isn't that well, right? Well, maybe so. <laughs> what a pair! Val and Hina and Soul Guard and Alm. Make sure you keep her safe on your way to the mana tree. <laughs> you bet I will. Why, hello, Salamando. This year you've got a delightful Alm. <laughs> of course I do. She's got passion, she's got spirit, and she's got fire in her soul. I better be off. Can't keep Sylphid waiting. See ya. Tell the rest of them hi for me. Fun little start. Spells bad, obviously, for Hina. Mr. Fugo, what's wrong? Did something happen? <sighs> it's the monsters again. We've got some more that made it past our patrols. All the way to the thicket outside of the village. Fast ones, too. I can take care of them. No sweat. <sighs> I hate to ask when you're on your way out, but could you? Think of it as one last chance to show us what you've learned. Hmm. I'll tell the rest of the villagers to steer clear of the thicket for now. We're counting on you, Val. Time to kill some rats in a dungeon. In a basement. The first the first quest in every RPG. You can change which ability seeds you have assigned to your character by going to the gear menu. Abilities have varying effects, such as improving your character's stats or allowing them to learn powerful moves. Your choice of skills can help you breeze through battles. Assign an ability to a character. Abilities boost your powers in battle, raising your character's stats, activating special effects. To learn an ability from an ability seed, you must assign it to a character. To learn an ability from the elemental plot, you must progress far enough along the plot for each element. Okay. You cannot assign two ability seeds of the same name to one character. You have to work within the limitations to find best combinations. Okay. Sure. So does this allow me to cast Fireball? Drive the monsters away from the thicket. Wow, you get a lot of moves. Huh. Interesting. Seems to be a lot going on.